Welcome to day three of NAB, and I'm so excited about all of you who watched. In fact, uh, my day one video did better than I possibly could have imagined, and a third of you watched all the way to the end. I can't even believe that, so thank you. But I kind of get it. I love coming to NAB. I love seeing all the new things, and um, you know, it's just a it's just a great vibe, and I'm sorry that you couldn't be here, and hopefully this will help you do that. Well, I'm not going to tell you what I'm going to watch today. Uh, right now, I'm going to um, put those up right here, and I'll just make a list of the booths that I'm going to be going to. I have timestamps down below, so you can just click onto the ones that you're most interested in and hopefully uh, have that experience as if you were here at NAB. And the first booth that I'm going to do today is the newer booth. Hey, how you doing? Good, how are you? Good, you getting tired? Day three? Yeah. Yeah, all right. Well, show me this contraption. What is this? Is this something you sell or just show off? Nope, this is our uh, new 360 booth, newer. Yeah? Uh, coming in at the competitive price point of $2,600 versus average competitor price of $5,000 or more. How much is it? Uh, $2,600. $2,600? What a savings. All right, let me, let me try it though, because yeah. it at least seems like fun. Does it look like fun? I put my own camera in there, is that what I do? Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, I like that. Do I put it regular mode, selfie mode? Um, you don't know what I do. It's up to me? Okay, I, I can do this. Screws, it's not a spring, so okay. it in there. You want to do vertical? You no, I want to, I want to do the landscape. Is that okay? Yeah. And that's your little device there that does that, right? Yeah, we got all sorts of phone mounts. I, I know. I've got some of your stuff. I've got some of your C-stands. Hey, our C-stands are like really good, actually. They are, I, yeah. All right, you got that? I got that going, I think. Is that going? Let's see if that's going. It says it is. Yup. All right, all right. Now what do I do? I stand here? Yeah, just stand here, and then I hit yeah, record, exactly. and then I'm gonna start it up. And then what do I do? Oh, wait, let me frame you up better. Do I look cool? I gotta frame you up. Do I, do I do this? Whatever you want. I like to stand on it and look real yeah, good. What's best? Well, no, really, well, <laughs> what, what, what should I do? What's the best look? What's the best look? Dance, some people just like to pose, some people like to, I don't know, be awkward, something I'll be awkward. All right. Let's do that. I'm ready. I'll be, which, by the way, means I'll dance. That's what that means. All right, here we go. Getting a little music going. This music really isn't for me. I don't know. It's kind of cool, man. Woohoo! I should be like, Woo! Yeah, now we're pretend. I'll pretend I'm like a, <laughs> Sorry, got a lot of people listening. Like I'm at the crap table or something. I think they just pay people at the crap table to go, Woo! <laughs> Every once in a while. All right. That's great, man. Well, next time I need a spinning iPhone $2,600 device, yeah. I'm I'm all over this. Directed towards, like, you know, event services providers. Did it, it did record. You hit stop, right? Yeah. Okay, I just wanted to make sure. <laughs> no, this would be sold to people doing, like, weddings. No, no, I, 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 I totally got you. I totally got you. I've been doing a live stream, actually, every day, and... This isn't live now, but but uh, what's, your, what's your channel about? It's called uh, um, it, it, reviewing stuff, yeah. like stuff you know, C stands and you know, cages and all kinds of stuff. Director you're, of uh, PR. Oh, you're an email, man. You're the guy yeah, I yeah, need yeah. to talk I'm the guy to. For that. Yeah, that's what I do all day. We're relatively small channel, but I just I did a walk a walkthrough on day one right. here, yeah. and I thought I'd get like 20 views or something. And I had 2,000 oh, so far. Hey. hey. I'm like, wow, that's never happened to me. So I've had more views than that, but not in 12 hours. I mean, you know, it's like. That's, that's great. I'm going to, I'll put this in the live stream. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. One, two, three. There we go. All right. We have uh, making uh, yeah. cages for your phone now. It's going to basically be like a camera cage. Yeah. So you can have a professional video rig for right. your phone because I mean, yeah, cause these are so these phones are so great now. I have a 15 so Max good. and they're so good. Yeah, so we just uh we just upgraded this. It's just getting checked in today. Yeah, but here's what I love about newer. Okay, you made a cage. I've looked at some cages. Look at the prices on these things. This is only $69 for that awesome cage, right? And I just looked at some others, and they wanted, you know, three times the money. Absolutely. Yeah, this is the new one we just came out with. This is the uh, new generation for the uh, 15 Pro Max. Okay. Give it a little bit, you know, nicer grip. It's, uh, it's quick release on it, so... You can change it horizontal, vertical, like on the phone. Oh, yeah, yeah. Fast. Feels a little bit better. Um, yeah, they're just super affordable. They're like, yeah. you know, 
Always, always really good quality stuff. Yeah, $45, $60. Yeah. Even your wireless microphone system here is only $139. This is the best lav mic you can buy. Really? Under $300. Hands down, well, absolutely. I'll, yeah. go, I'll go under. Okay, you're going to do that? You're going to say that? I will say that. All right. Like, the CM28 is a fantastic, CM28? fantastic lav mic. You know, everybody's making a lav mic nowadays. They are, but for like... I mean, it's 140, but we always have a dis discount deal going on somewhere. Wait a minute, wait a minute. You have discount deals on top of your 139? We do. And we have a special one oh. till the 20th. Till the 20th, right here, and they can get that 31 percent off everything on the store. We did that what? specifically for NAB. Oh man. Okay. Well, that is going to go in the stream as well. Uh, that is exciting. I'm, I'm going to put that card right this here in my pocket. I'd recommend that to personal friends. Well, it's, it's that good. Let's just check them out here, okay? They're very much like my DJI mic, only, you know what, they're a little lighter. Um, yeah. So, Do they do 20, 20, 32 boot float and everything? Yeah, so the, and it comes with adapters for, um, you put it oh, into yeah, your yeah. iPhone for lightning, iPhone, you know, or lightning. the regular C port. Um, oh, that's cool. Four gigs of storage. Let's look at this transmitter. Oh, no, that's not the transmitter. This is the receiver. receiver. Yeah. Oh, the receiver's got a nice screen on it. Mm-hmm. That's nice. And it also clips, so you can put it pretty much anywhere. Absolutely. And I'm guessing that will slip in, go into my hot shoe right there. Yeah. Or, or uh, so it would just... Like a regular camera, right? Eh? Am I wrong? The the transmitter? On a, on a regular camera? On a camera? Yeah. So it has just the... Uh, yeah. Yeah. And plus the C port. Plus that. Okay. Yeah. Um, but on this, what we like wanted to add was not everybody has a nice lapel you can like clip onto. Yeah, yeah. So we gave a super powerful magnet. Oh, yeah. So you can clip it on anywhere on clothing, and it sure. can be thick clothing and not fall off like I've seen some other ones do. Yeah, the old, the original DJI ones were pretty weak, uh, but they're, ooh, that's pretty strong. Yeah. Uh, the new DJI ones are a lot stronger, which is good. I would hope so. But yes, <laughs> well, for, I'm going to say, is it two times, three times the yeah, money it's, it's a for the DJI <laughs> mic system? But it's still, you know, 400 foot range. And 32 bit float and all the stuff. We'll do a backup recording then to the, to the unit itself. To it, yeah. Each one has uh, four gigs. To it, so. Four gigs to it. That's great. Um, yeah, just I mean, maybe there's a few features that the higher. No, 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 no. I don't think so. I, I mean, uh, it's uh, in a nice case. Whoops, I I, I messed that up. I <laughs> yeah, these, these here, these go, these go into here. this little clip right there, yeah. which I can see. Yeah, it's live TV, so you know there's going to be. Oh, Oh, there, oh, oh, I broke it. No, I'm kidding. Also, these have a six hour battery life on them. Oh, I put that in wrong. That's yeah. my, my problem. Yeah. It has a six hour battery that life and uh, like three or four charges with the case itself. So, yeah, and probably USB C in the back there. Absolutely. Yeah, just like, yeah, yeah, well, you've done it. You've, uh, yeah, you've done it. We much solved cheaper. It. You have lots of <laughs> other things. I've got some, I think I have one of your cages that I use on my larger uh, camera over here. And now you're doing lights because I, uh, you, you, I, Seems like I didn't know you for lights at first, but now it seems like you're doing more and more lights. We were, Is that we right? were originally best known in photography for our lighting setup. Oh, really? Yeah, we've been oh. around a while. We were just real specific to the photography, uh, you know, family. Oh, that's there. nice. That feels nice. Yeah. A touch bar. You have a touch bar. Yeah, it has a touch bar on, on your so. what? Tell me about so that. You want to control it for here, full RGB on the touch Holy bar. Cow. Or you can set everything, you know, manually sure. through the buttons. But it also um, Bluetooth to the app on your phone. Awesome. Just like all of our other lights, you can group them all together. So you can set the same color temperature if you have multiple lights. Yeah. Uh, you can yeah. lock it afterwards if you don't want to hit the, uh, really, really, the bar by accident. Really nice. It's of course, fantastic. nothing looks, you know, it all looks a little weird yeah. when you go directly to the light. Also but when you're back, looking at the source itself, you know, yeah. putting the light on it, it's uh, that's awesome. The back is magnetic too, so you can like snap it on. The whole yes. back. Yep. Oh yeah, that's awesome. Well, and look at that price, eighty nine dollars. Yeah. And did I mention to my viewers that I have a card here somewhere that I showed earlier for? I got it for uh, thirty one percent off. And all you have to do is NAB24, which is not difficult to remember. Yeah, so. we try to make it easy. Yeah, you did make it very easy. So that's great. Oh, and look, it will. Was this uh? Is this like a filters? Yeah, we make filters. You make filters for cameras. You got a mat box. Oh man, look at this! I love the prices, man. And well, I love the two things: the prices and how sturdy they feel in your hands. Yeah. You know, because prices. I mean, something that <laughs> something's really good is worth more money. Yeah. Uh, but these, uh, you I, can I, find cheaper, but you're not going to find cheaper at the quality that we provide. That's, that's exactly what I was thinking about newer, and I bought a number of little things for, it, especially when I just need a little. I don't know, gadget or something to do this and that and the other. Look at this. You've also got an egg crate for them. Does that come with it? Yeah, or you buy that comes separately? With it. it comes yeah. with it? Yeah. For the 89 bucks? Dude, you're killing it. Wait, wait. 
What happened here? You cut one in half. It's just Small tiny. inversion? Yeah. Those are light. Those are, <laughs> this come in, those are like, I don't know, 25-ish dollars. Uh, They're great, though. 25 bucks? Yeah, for a little fill light or splash light. They're full RGB color. Um, they actually get super bright, too. I know a lot of people use them. Oh, look at the... And this actually remote controls and moves? Yep. No way. Absolutely. <laughs> oh. This is fun. Yeah, and we like to come out so people can actually, like, you know, hold something in their hand and play with it and see if they actually like it, you know, before they purchase it. Yeah, no, I'm glad I stopped by for sure. All right, anything else I need to see or must see before I go? Must see, uh, just so you know, with uh, the phone cage here, yeah. now you're going to be able to put on all of your filters. different filters. So when you're outside, oh, you know how important that. an ND filter is. Like, you're, I you're do know how important an ND filter is. Uh, especially for like this little uh, this little guy here. If you go outside, you need an ND filter because there's no variable aperture on this thing. Yeah. So, so filters for that. So you got what? <laughs> You've got them right here for the camera I'm shooting on. Tell me about these. Sixty-two dollars. Looks like you've got a. I can't see because I have too much light behind me. Um, is it? I, I, there's got to be a, a. Is that a circular polarizer there in the bottom right? This, this kit here is the ND60 polarizer, yeah, 32, 64, UV, CPL. Yeah, so that's going to come with all those for 62 bucks. Yeah, no, that's great. That's a great deal. You got to have an ND filter for your Osmo Pocket 3, for sure. Awesome. Hey, this has been great. Thanks I will so give you, Brandon, wait, wait. Brandon Wolf. No, see, I don't, I'm not buying it because you... <laughs> it got you, smudged. Oh, is that what happened? Yeah. Okay, I was just going to say. No, absolutely. I think you're just using an alias or something. You probably work in a different booth. You just came over here and switched all <laughs> the prices. I'm just pretending to be newer. Yes, to be really low so I would get super excited, <laughs> which, by the way, I am. Thanks so much for your time. Yeah, thank you. I, I really appreciate, appreciate coming by here, and I will definitely get a hold of you. Yeah. And then if you've got new products coming out, that kind of stuff, and I'd now, love to... You know, if you use this uh, footage, shoot me a link so we can check it out. Maybe we can tag you guys and... Uh, yeah, I'll do it. I'll do it. Love Sounds it. great. Absolutely. Thanks, man. Well, that was awesome. I'm liking that. You know, Newer does make really good stuff, and I bought them that very inexpensive, especially when you just need a little something like a hot shoe mount for, you know, to put a monitor on or something like that. Their stuff is very high quality, well made, and it's uh, very inexpensive. Oh, this is kind of cool. You didn't tell me about this. This is their, their slider. I wonder how much this costs. Well, you can go online and I guess you can get it for 31% off right now using that promo code. I'm pretty excited about that. Yeah, very excited about that. All right, let's go see what else we can find here at NAB. Okay, so one of the things I got a request for is to go back to the Canon booth and actually talk to someone there and find out if there is anything new from Canon. And I don't think there's anything new, but let's just let's just go find out. Let's just see what they have to say. Yeah. Oh, how do I flip that around? Yeah, oh, there we go. Again, I'm using the Pocket 3, and I have the uh, DJI uh, mic hooked up to it directly, which is one of my favorite features. I have it on a little flimsy Ulanzi stand that I love because it's so light and easy to work with. Let's see if anybody here is willing to talk to me. Well, these are the experts. Look at them. They all got their Canon shirts on. They look like they're good here. Flip this around. How you doing? How's it going? Good. Is there anything new? I'm doing a live stream and I wanted to find out if there's anything new. Everything's old. You have nothing new for NAB. What's your coolest thing then? Oh yeah, I've heard about this. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. How how new this is relatively new, isn't it? January time frame. Oh yeah. Alright, let me. So I guess the get that. Oh man. Feels good. I'm gonna give you that. Oh yeah. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. You know, I expect it to be heavier than that, but it's uh, it's pretty light. All right. Anything else that my uh, content creator friends would want to know about from Canon this year? Anything new going on at the booth or something? The EF version of it. No. There's uh, low light cameras over there. Check out like super high sensitivity low light cameras. Really? Okay. 
PTZ is going on over here. So yeah, PTZ is making a, you know, everybody's zooming something yep. everywhere. Yeah, a lot of broadcast yeah. stuff. Have you walked around the other? I did. I came by the other day, but some, one of my listeners wanted me to come back because okay. they were swear, sure that Canon would have something for them. Uh, but you always do have a nice set, and it's always fun to be able to touch the stuff that you're most interested yeah. in. Wait, wait, wait. What's this right here? That is the dual fish eye. So oh. it's supposed to create VR content. Is that the coolest camera lens? Holy cow! Can I can I even look through it? How does it? How does this work? So it splits the sensor in half. I can't see anything. Is it not on? Ah, well, that you got to do have to turn it on. No way! Oh, I wish I could show. If you could see that, that would be really cool. Oh, you can kind of see it on the back. Look at that. Yeah. Not in okay, this that's room. that's pretty cool. So it splits the screen in half, so you have tools for VR for things like the Oculus. So you see. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Well, you know, you don't have anything new, but you had some things new yeah. for me. Yeah, so that's right. Hey, thanks so much for talking to me. Yeah. No Appreciate it. Let's go check out those low light cameras. You know, those expensive cameras that I can't afford. But there's there's always things here. Let me show you a little bit more of the. Oh yeah, they're back to. Uh, our violin player, who just has to play violin for hours. Awesome. Oh, and this girl over here is still twirling that uh, yellow ribbon. Yeah, I used that. Man, I would be uh, completely worn out. I am actually completely worn out from being here at NAB. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, look at the size of that lens. You know, the reason I don't hang out the uh, Canon booth very much is that they have things that I can't afford. Virtual production, huge giant lenses that cost more than my house. Ah, this is awesome. You know, virtual production is taking over the world. Look at that screen in the background. That's pretty cool. And then you can actually try it out right here and then you can see it right on the monitor, right up there. Let's see what it looks like. Well, that's pretty pretty cool. All right, thanks to the listener who wanted to see more from the Canon booth. Because, you know, I did pick some things up. Oh, here we are, though, at Insta360, and I did want to be here. Well, I can't get that to go up that high. Insta360 has the new X3. Hey, Mark, how you doing, man? Hey, man, how are you? Good, good. Now I'm, I'm blogging today here, so wait. No, we got to I'm doing it again. Me. I know. You're gonna do it too? You have one? What are you? Yeah. Check you, this out. Yeah. Now, this is the, the X3. Yeah. So, I have one of those. Like a chump. Yeah. Right? You just and barely bought it? It. Well, I was sent it. Oh, and really? I was in the process of reviewing, of reviewing it. it. And now I, and now it's, it's obsolete. It's this, not obsolete. It's still great. It's yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Don't, just, yeah. I always want yeah. the newest thing. We don't wanna, we don't wanna tick them off, all right? Yeah. Uh, well, look, well, check this one. What, what do you got? Same one? I have same one, only yeah. mine has this giant scratch on the lens. Mm, mm. And now the X4, you could probably have this one. <laughs> the X4 is like, um, has little um, things you can put on it, and you can actually buy glass ones. It comes with plastic ones, but it comes with, you know. Yeah, I know. they, they, had they were a, demoing that. The big protected filter, and yeah. No, yeah. Yeah. So. yeah. I, I mean, I like this. Yeah? Yeah. Do you use this Sorry much? To interrupt. Oh, yeah, yeah. We're looking into buying one of these. Oh, do yeah? Like it? I do like it. I'm actually live streaming Are right now. Really? That's our, yeah. So we're, but, we're live streaming. Well, yeah. so, uh, faux live stream. Oh, I'm, I'm just going to go live. I walk the floor, and then I give them what I do, and whatever screw ups happen, I, I, I go this. with. Everyone but has I love it. This is, this is, this is, this is, this is, absolute I shouldn't be here at the Instant 360 booth talking about the 360 camera and praising the DJI Listen, of the I, I probably I shouldn't be I doing that. Both. Where are you from? Liberty University? Yes. Hey, Jason, it's good to meet it's, you. Yeah, just, you won't be disappointed. Get that. All right. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, guys. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything about this camera. Everything. You have one of these, right? Yeah, absolutely. All right. All right. I, I, uh, I buy a lot of things. <laughs> but yeah, I have this. And sometimes people send you stuff for free. Yes, they do. Now, does it does is it, it free if you have to have to make a video for make it a video and sweat your blood? Do you know what I mean? I have to learn to ski. Yes, it's to free. To do this. Oh, you did. You learned no, to ski? I don't. No, I don't do. But that's that's my big problem with doing a lot of these. I know. I'm a great endorsement, so I do not go outside and do stuff. But so you you. Well, that, we're also, we're on, also on that screen over yeah. there. Yeah, there's, there's we, cameras everywhere. There's, there are cameras everywhere at NAB. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna get over there and take a look at the new X4. 
But the problem with the, does the extra four use different batteries? Because I bought those extra battery packs and everything. I think it does. You know what? It is. We can look at it right there and compare. Right here. Let's do it. Let's just compare. Um, it looks like it's a bigger body. All right. Let's steal the battery. Let's, let's get it out here. I hope they don't arrest us. I hope I can't get my fingers on that thing. Are you any good at this? I think I got it. I think so. So that one's. That is a different battery. A different battery. All right. Well, there's that. Different battery than the X3. Yes. Yeah. 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 All right. That would have been easier. That would have been the nice. Lady right next to I could have. I, I could have. But, but you need to tear things apart. <laughs> maybe. Maybe I do. Oh, look. Here it is. You know what's really funny? I went to uh, the booth here, and they were they were still plugging the X3 yesterday. Yeah. As if you know, and as if we all didn't know this was coming out. Yeah. I'm sure they had really cool visuals up there for it, huh? They did. I taped it all on the all right. X3. Did you? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Can you put it up for everybody to see? No, I'm going to keep it. I'm going to put a link, though, to your website here, Mark, uh, right here, so everybody can see it. I will put it up later. You won't see it. That's the wrong one. No, no. It's, it's the wrong it's, it's one. The, I don't got... go there. <laughs> you don't know what the site he's directing you to. Don't listen to this, man. Uh, uh, yes, uh, it might drain your bank account Maybe. if you go to that, uh, go to that well, link. My, my channel tends to do that anyway. Oh, yeah, Because people me like too. me see my type of channel, and then they buy, buy, buy. Yeah. Like me. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, I'm. Gonna, I gotta go to the airport now. I'm this done. This is it. You're done. I'm done. Is yeah. that you just came to see this and now you're gone? I'm leaving tomorrow. Yeah. But I'm gonna do some more. Uh, Mark, so it's good to see you. Oh yeah. I'm by, set, by that. I met you yesterday for the first time. But, <laughs> but you know, <laughs> that's what I love about good. NAB. Still, still always good. good. Still always good to see you. Definitely two for two. Yeah, sounds yeah, good. Maybe. I'll see you next year. You're coming next year? Yeah. 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 They because. They can't stop me from coming in. I can just buy a ticket. I know. And I then know. I get to go in. So you, I always go. You buy a ticket? No, you no get a free I didn't. Ticket. I was going to say, yeah, you yeah. get a free ticket. I was, I was, you ever come to NAB, you can pick up a free ticket somewhere. They'll sell you a ticket. Yeah. But yeah, just, I don't even know how much it was. It used to be 50 be bucks. But oh, no, it's like 350 350 to yeah, get a yeah. ticket. You get, or you just go online and find someone who will give one for free. Or you register as press if you're super important. Oh, is that how it goes? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, if you, if you well, cover did, the I event. Did, I didn't know that. Yeah, if you cover the event, wow. they will give you a press pass, but you have to prove it. Oh, you have yeah. a press pass? Yeah. You have a news media. See, yours says news media. Mine says exhibit pass. Well. Mine was given to me by somebody else. Yeah, well, th this makes sense because I, I notice as you walk, people part as yeah. you go by. Oh, yeah. Well, some yeah. of that is... Wow. You know, I, I, a, I'm a little gamey. I mean, it's, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's rough. You know, uh, not a lot of showers here in Vegas. No, they're, you know I mean? they're not. They're just they spread apart. Yeah. No. All right, I'm off. Now. All right, man. Okay, buddy. Good luck. Back See to ya. Canada. Back to Before Canada. they deport you. Yeah. See you, man. Yeah. All right, that's Mark Bennett. I like his uh, channel. I got to meet him yesterday at Condor Blue. Um, I didn't video that. I just hung out with him. It was kind of fun. So... Yeah, uh, he's a great guy, and I, I've been following him. I met a lot of people uh, over at Condor Blue. In fact, I think I'll go over to Condor Blue in a little bit, and I'll bet you all the influencers are going to be there because they like to hang out. You know one thing about this Pocket 3 is I find myself looking at the screen all the time. I should be looking at you. I'm going to work on that as well. Let's get around here, though, and take you through the booth. Let's see what's going on. More people doing exactly what I'm doing, showing things off, doing a little live stream. Say hi. Hi. Look Is that it? Brand new. Are you kidding? You want it? Well, no, I bought it. You I bought it. it you can buy it here. Working really hard. Yeah. Oh, I only right. have 50, and they've sold at least 30 so far. How so. much are they? Like 520, 520? something, 527. Is it the whole kit? Is it the better kit or something? Or yeah, the cool? Yeah, it's the kit, but they give you, they throw in the invisible stick. selfie stick. Yeah. Guess yeah. what? Here's a hint for your viewers. What? All in, all selfie sticks are invisible if they're between the two lenses. <laughs> There's no like magic, you know, where they go poof and it vanishes. Yeah. I always like it when people are like snowboarding. You can see the, the shadow, but not the stick. Right. Yeah. Yeah. When are they going to get rid of the shadow? That's what I want. You know, you can. Somebody's working on it. Uh, I know somebody's working on it. Now, I'm in news, so I wouldn't do this, but you can do it by, uh, you there can do it by putting it into um, DaVinci Resolve. Yeah. Just draw into the shadow. It will auto track forward and back. And now you can adjust that mat. Good point. And, and if it's snow, it's easy. 
I can yeah. all just adjust the feather that feather that mat out a little bit. So what you're saying is that even though you're in news and you would never do that, would, you do I it would, all the time. But I no, wouldn't. I'm just kidding. But you would. All right, right. We actually kidding. have a really strict ethical code. Yeah. Uh, I work for Great Television, and we have an AI committee yeah. where we approve every single vendor, and and we don't use generative AI in news at all. Well, that's good. Period. That's good. What news organization is this? Great Television. So we own okay. stations in 113 markets. Wow. Uh, I'm in Atlanta. Oh, let's just take a look at this thing. You're you're my first uh, unboxing, my baby. first unboxing right here. Let's just unboxing. Let's get in there. Yeah, take yeah. Yeah. Oh, I thank you. Look, look at this. Oh yeah, man. Right? Yeah. And it has a, a little cover. This on is a it. chick magnet right here. You can oh, see yeah. women what? coming from uh, all over. Well, there look at there, <laughs> there are two women here. Well, I'm out of saying, out of 400. This is nerd prom. Right? It is. Oh, totally, man. Totally. You know, uh, I came up here without my wife, and she doesn't um, care because she said, "Look, there's, you're not going to meet anybody in Vegas uh, except some dude uh, who's so uh, funny. To totally into uh, all, it's already cameras." Try, it's already trying to open. Look, I just tried to take a picture of it, and it, it's it's wanting to open the scan, the, the, the scan yeah, code for. for uh, the installing the installing the uh, yeah. oh, look, quick start guide. That's pretty good. Well, you're gonna have to get some extra batteries because the old batteries don't work on that. Yeah, they say this one lasts longer, twice as long. So. Well, there you go. Well, that's good. So there you go. My problem with the Insta360 has been solved by this camera. Uh, in fact, I had it here a little bit ago. I was just showing it to someone. I have a scratch on my lens. Yeah, well, that's what so these the lens new guards. Yeah, lens guards are huge. Yeah. Uh, whoops! I just ripped it. I'm a terrible. I can, I can see that, but uh, you know, luckily I'm a terrible cameraman. So how do you, how do you I love this. Camera? I love this thing. Oh yeah, this is, fantastic. this is my favorite camera. I I brought my A7S III uh -huh. last year, and I brought it again here, and I did this on the first day, and I went, I'm not, I'm not yep. lugging that huge I have thing that around. Too. Okay, this is right. a great camera. The depth of right. field's great. You know, the thing is though, you're bringing a DJI product with it's the 360 booth. Yeah, I'm kind of, I'm, uh, I'm liking that. Look at, that, I'm getting a lot of attention yeah. from this thing. Yeah, it's amazing. This thing, this thing is, my, I love everything about it. And, it, and and this little crappy stand here, I'll show the stand uh, from Ulanzi. Uh, it just uh, it's tiny, it's wobbly, it's nothing. But if you put a gimbal on it, who cares? Nobody nobody cares, and just snaps right onto the battery pack, and and then you kind of triple tap around here, and then they're near to where we're talking and blogging. Although you know this is kind of annoying, but you kind of have to flip it up like that. Yeah. You have one of these? No, I I was debating between this. And the uh, I got the RS Mini, and I put my oh, yeah? Sony on it. Oh yeah. Uh, little A. Oh yeah. Uh, I have that. ZV-E10. I don't have a ZV-E10, but I have the RS Mini, the DJI. It's great, but it's uh, it's heavy and big. And yeah. The coolest thing about this, I'm just I'm now I'm doing a plug for for uh, DJI, is that I have a little uh, their microphone, and I just right, got it yeah. uh, right here, and uh, I put it up a little Shure mic that I that I have that was like 80 bucks or something. And then the whole microphone itself, so I just throw it in my pocket. And this little guy right here goes directly in there without a transmitter. So you don't have to put it on the camera and put this thing on or whatever. It's all in there. And it'll do two of these, and I have two. And uh, so I can, if I you know, need to, I can pull another one out. And I find that I can get this conversation. And it'll also make a backup recording here. So if I miss it, the, it's got three microphones on the camera that aren't bad. Uh huh. So I, now I feel like a sales rep for for the Osmo Pocket 3. Yeah, I should have ordered both and tried it out, you know. Yeah. But I went down to DJI and my gimbal is like making little shakes on the oh, really? like, oh, we think you have a bad motor. Oh. So I'm just going to send it back to Amazon, but I'm not going to. They'll fix it, but I'm just going to send it back. Yeah, Amazon. send it back. Oh, that's one of the great things about Amazon. Well, it's nice to meet you, Richard. Yeah, thanks. Thanks. That's All right. Cool. All right, I'm, 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 I'm coming back, though. I'm coming back. You're working, you're, oh, you put, took off the little screen. Whoops. Yeah. They said it came with standard lens covers. It does, but I think they're in. Somewhere. They're hiding. Oh. They, are they in there? At the bottom of this box? I don't know. Let's not drop it. Yeah, don't one. drop it on day one. Let's see what, no, that's silica gel. It could be, is it under here? Oh, wait, there's some fingers in here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> they said it yeah. came with two plastic yeah. covers. They did. They lied they to you. Did. They're in here. They might be. They're tiny. No, those are little books. Oh, no, wait. No, 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 there, there, there it is. Standard lens guards. Standard lens guards right in there. Very Without fascinating it. the way they, well, there it is. Okay. Yeah, well, one, uh, two, little, three. One, two, three. Do that. I think you got it. They're telling it. you how to turn it on and off, yeah. put it on and off. It's, That's good. Basically, it's kind of like a, an EF mount lens thing. You put it on with a button and you right. turn it. 
Yeah, put those on right away, buddy, because mine has a huge scratch and I quit using it. And here, you're recording me. I am. Sorry, man. No, you're fine. I'm recording. So now, you. now I'm recording you. What? Recording me. You're recording no. on this? No. On that? Your glasses? Yes. Holy cow! You got to be kidding me. Yeah. I love how pulse is a little light, so I can see yeah. it. Tell me about these. What are It's a Ray-Ban. Uh, I might want to tilt down a little bit. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm sorry. The, I keep I, I keep looking at the, at the real real life I mean, instead the of the screen. I know. I yeah, know. these Sorry. are the Ray-Ban Meta glasses. They have a camera and a speakers. It's a smart speaker. All about how she does. Under my prescription glasses and their sunglasses, they turn you know transition. So stick around. Oh, yeah. How much was how much was that bargain? Oh geez, I don't know. Oh, they, Enough they won't that tell I you. Have to ask my wife for permission. I, I, okay, yeah, I understand that. But I don't know your wife, so I don't know what your limit is. Find out here. Oh. Finding the you, magic. You know what I'm wondering about these is are there be any more flare as a result? You know, I do get it on my one inch. Yeah. Uh, I do get lens flare. Do you have a than little protect, protection on your one inch like this? No, or? it's just the standard. Just the standard one inch, one inch gives you more sure. more flare. Man, how many gadgets do you have? You're a wearing lot. a Go 3, yep. right? Yep. You've got the uh, X3. You just bought the, uh, yeah. Yeah. Yep. Does your wife even know? I, I think I, I feel like I need to, like, uh, get your wife's email and send her a video. Yeah. Well, some of this is work. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, work, work, yeah. No, no, I, I understand. Trust me. Really, it's work. Really, I got it. <laughs> what did I do with the other lens? Oh, I don't know. It's right there. Okay, good. I don't want you to lose that thing. I'm ADD. If I'm not paying attention, it's not good. Sure. No, no. I think most of us here are. What well, one of the things they discovered, uh, everyone's trying to activate their X4s. And the thing is, typically when you open a new product, there aren't 50 other exact versions of that product all trying to activate at the same time. Oh, so yeah. There's a, if I'd read the instructions. I yeah, you did. This. One, two, three. It's a little dot. I said a dot. You turn it, right? There it is. There you go. So now I should be able to. They, these are plastic, they said. Yeah. And uh, to, and and then they're going to have um, glass ones available. Glass ones that are like more yeah. premium. more more money. Yeah. The uh, the plastic ones will be probably be a little more durable. But um, oh, I keep I keep going up, man. I'm like like, like I'm getting a whole video of the ceiling over here. At, at, I wonder uh, if this blocks the. Yeah, it does. Yeah. No, it doesn't block any of the doors. This is cool. This little thermo cover, so it yeah. get on your hand. That's pretty cool. I'm trying. It is definitely a little heavier than the X2. Oh, My problem is I have a hard time with 360 cameras because it's just more work and post for me, no and I'm not really good no about question. it. And 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 well, I also well okay. So let's just let's just do this, right? Let me just show you this. So if I've got a shot, and I, and I'm here, well we'll do it right here. I'll do it of this iPad, okay? And I want to I want to be here, and I want to dolly down here, but I kind of want this camera in the background, right? Right. So I find my composition, and I and I get it, right? With the, with the with this camera, you're just kind of you know throwing it around and hoping something happens. That is and, true. The and you get back, and you go, oh, I wish that were just a little bit over here's there. A, here's the difference. If I'm on vacation. Yeah. I can be in the moment. Oh yeah. Just make sure this is rolling. Yeah. And I can just hold it out in front of me, spend time with the family, and then later, when I'm just sort of you know calming down at the end of the night, I can dynamically reframe the footage. Or that's a long true. Flight back from. I'm not saying it doesn't have its advantages. And look at these things. Look at these things. These things are amazing. What people are doing. It's pretty wild. But let me ask you this question. You ever done that? I've done that. I've sat. I've sat on the beach. I could do that. I could do sit on the beach. I keep I do it. I keep looking down, and my hand just goes up. It's not clear where the SD card is. Oh, Wait, you know, I'm going to leave you that to to that. Oh, thank you. And I'm going to take off. An absolute delight. Uh, again, I'm I'm going straight live stream on this thing. So gotcha. Good good luck on on. Uh, oh wait. Yeah. Does that have? It has a little quarter twenty on the bottom. You like that? I love this thing. People have been asking me about this all the time. Yeah. yeah. Hey, here here's my card, and you can look for day three all right, and cool. scroll through it all, and then give that. I'm gonna give that to your wife so she can see what you've actually Very done. Funny. Yeah, I'm sorry. Thank you. Thank yeah, no, I love this thing. See, this little little guy gimbals around. It has a um, doesn't matter how you hold it really, and um, and you can actually face track it. Here, let's just face track you. Right. Oh, cool. Wait, wait, wait. I 
I focused, but I didn't face it. There now, what? Well, now you're active track. So now, if you move around, it's going with you. That's very cool. Isn't that fun? I get. I've been. Uh, I've, I've seen a lot of them around here, but I've also been getting a lot of attention from it. Um, and then you just you can Does triple it tap. Four K. It shoots in 4K. This is and it'll shoot at 4K 60, I think. I just got it at 24 here because, you know, I'm not doing wild, creative stuff. You know, I'm yeah. just out here. Now, what do you use it for? Um, mostly for my YouTube channel that I have, and just really? grabbing a quick shot here or whatever. Uh -huh. I have an A7S III, and I just I left it home. This thing's so much easier. That is and so cool. So much easier to do. How how is it different than the... Well, that, will you, you reframe later when you get home. This is what you see is what you get. So if I miss the shot or, like, lots of times I'll start to drift up and not get it, I can't reframe it. Here you can reframe. Got but it. But that's, those are hard to, those take some getting used to. Yeah, so. I bet, I bet. So uh, can you shoot vertical with that? Oh, yeah. All you do is flip the screen to vertical. Oh, nice. But, but it doesn't split the camera to vertical. It just changes the aspect ratio and it's not 4k anymore it's like 2.7 or something don't hold me to that number but it. it'll okay. do that so it'll do it and but i think if i flip it it might just turn off and i don't want to flip it okay no worries all right Thanks sounds good all right good luck thank you all right man oops I'm gonna get this back on its stand triple tap that well that was fun maybe too much fun having a good time hey it's nice to meet you likewise we'll see you now, one thing they do here a lot is they have these presentation screens and they'll have presenters up here. Uh, yesterday, uh, my good friend David Manning, who I met at NAB here last year, and who was kind enough to actually give me uh, a uh, shirt. And he had a 3XL, which uh, most people don't have. So shout out to David Manning for all the stuff that he's done. If you want to know about action cameras and uh, gathering moments with your family and things, he is a great great resource on action cameras in fact his uh, his channel is uh, helped me a lot um, and of course he has uh, all the insta360 cameras all the gopros all the whatever and he tests them all and lets you know which one is better and better than the other all right well that was fun for me maybe you got a little long i do find that i get a lot of people who are interested in this camera and they all want to see it and they're not shy about it. All right, what do we got here? We've got we got a raffle going on. Now, it's another thing I haven't really talked about is raffles. They um, there's usually always something where you can uh, can win something. Let's find out how to win something. Would you like to win something? Yeah. I should do a raffle. I did a raffle once and it didn't really work out very well for me. I raffled off a light, um, a, uh, an Amaran light, and um, the guy who won it was from India and it cost me more money to ship it than the light cost. So I just bought him another one on Amazon and I still have that light. In fact, it's the same light that I just won another light from Amaran uh, from a couple nights ago at uh, a little party that uh, Amaran was throwing that I got to attend. But you probably heard about that if you watched some of my other videos of day one and day two. So now I'm starting to repeat myself a little bit. But again, there's always things that you can win and little freebies that you can get. So, you know, I, I picked up one of those yesterday. Hey, how you doing? So, are you have a raffle? Yes, we have a raffle. How do you do at that? 3 PM. At three? So, yeah, at three PM, you need to have uh, be in person here. Be in person? So, yeah. So just uh, share some uh, whatever products you like. Okay. On our uh, on your Instagram or other social media. Okay. Hashtag us, and that's it. That's it. Yes. Yeah, so you will get a raffle ticket, and then you can. What, what, what will I? What will you get? Will I get? The, the raffle tickets. So it's just the the raffles for that. Yes. Okay, and then I get the raffle card, then yes. put it in there. Yes. So I have to. Just show so I have to one. sign up for Instagram or something. Yeah. Uh, you don't have any, Facebook. Uh, yeah. Maybe. Facebook, okay. Instagram. I'll do that a little bit later and see if I can win that something. It looks pretty cool. Well, I'll see if I can actually post something on social media. You know, I don't. I don't Instagram. I rarely Facebook. I use Facebook to see how my nieces and nephews are doing. Um, let's see, there was something else, of course. We got a little little thing going on at uh, Small Rig. question for Andrews and Morgan. All right. 
Me first? Yeah. first? More people over there. What made you realize that focus? Oh, somebody wanted me to go to the Nikon booth, and I'm going to do that now because it's right here. So let's do that. Let's see what we've got. And by the way, I mean, I don't know what they want to see at the Nikon booth, but here is the Nikon booth. Um, Nikon and Red, or Nikon bought Red, so that's kind of cool. Let's see if we can get someone to talk to us. You know, sometimes when I come to a place like this and I see, um, you know, <laughs> things that are definitely out of my price range, I'm like, okay, I'm not stopping there. I don't need a, a PZ camera. I don't need all these things. But uh, but surprisingly, sometimes there are things that I need. Of course, that's, uh, that's just the Ronin gimbal doing in the Nikon booth. Showing off the Nikon, I'm sure. Hey, how you doing? Hey, we're doing a little live stream. Is there anything new from... Uh, Oh, I'm not allowed to be recorded, I'm sorry. Oh, okay. Yeah. Fair enough. But if you'd like to redo an interview, though, I'll play Jeff over there. Yeah. All right. I'll do it. Yeah. Not allowed to do an interview. You might spill the beans about something. Yeah. Hey, Jeff. How's it going? Doing a little live stream here. Okay. Hello. So, is there any... Uh, I had one of the... I did a live stream every day. Okay. And I had somebody say, you got to go, and I need Nikon and Red Booth. I got to find out what's new. And I'm like, I walked by it. I don't... Find out just, what's new. They just, bought Red. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I got a t-shirt that it commemorates that. Yeah. Like, you're wearing one right now. I got... I the, yeah, I got this shirt. Yeah. So, that's good. Yeah. So what, what I can say about that is uh, we are really, really looking forward to working with Red and collaborating. Uh, you mm -hmm. know, we've had the chance to be uh, working with them, you know, coming into this show. Uh, the two technologies together are going to be absolutely amazing, and we really cannot wait to see what happens. So let me let me summarize. Yes. You love Red. Yes. Everyone loves Red. Come on, make, it make, they make great stuff, right? Yes. But you don't have anything new. because we, you, At this show, we are not showing anything new. So it's what's your bad. next big show? Uh, I'll stop back. I gotta go record. Um, so next big show, uh, I'm not sure what we're doing yet, uh, oh, yeah. but stay tuned. We'll have more. So is every, everything in flux now or there, or just no? It's about uh, we, same old, we, same old. We have a uh, so right now everything is remaining. Uh, the red brand, uh, sales, service, support, uh, retailers, everything remains the same. And we'll just see what happens in the coming years. Yeah. We're all looking for that Nikon raw files, right? Is well, you know, that's asking? an interesting question. And what we're kind of seeing right that's now That's why is I asked that, it, because um, it was interesting. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah. Go ahead. Uh, so, you know, Red Code Raw exists. Yeah. And NRAW exists. Yeah. And they exist in two very different planes. The NRAW, it's a, it's a very light file format that, you know, we have in the Z8 and Z9. Yeah. Um, you know, very low memory. It's, it's a great, you know, 12-bit file. But then you got Red Code Raw, which is, you know, more of a 16-bit, heavier, amazing dynamic range, amazing yeah. file to work with. And, you know, they both kind of exist in their own, uh, for their own use cases. Well, so we'll see what happens. You know, a lot of companies that buy out like that will continue to hold those separate brands for the separate, you know, uh, audiences that they're reaching, right? So that may happen. Or we might see some, some cross integration that makes one go to the other, right? Hey, no matter what so, it is, we can't wait to see what happens. Yeah, it's going to be fun. Hey, thanks yeah. so much for taking time. No problem. Have a good Appreciate one. Appreciate it. All right. All right. Okay. Well, there we go. We've got the uh, the news straight from the source. And as I said, there's really nothing going on here except these t-shirts, which you can get. And I, I, I got one. They only had a 2XL, though, so it's a little tight. But hey, I've been losing a little weight, so, you know, you never know. All right, let's see what else there is right now. Yeah. So Condor Blue is uh, another company, sort of, you know, that makes rigging equipment for content creators. But somehow, content, Condor Blue uh, really, I don't know, the content creators really like them. So if you, we go here to this booth, I'll bet we'll find some people that you recognize. Right here at Condor Blue. Well, there's their Condor, and yeah, it's blue. Huh? They got that going for us so far. Let's see. Who's in the booth today? Oh, great. I totally like. I'm not recognizing anyone here. Maybe they all just kind of came at once. Or maybe you recognize people that I don't. Oh, I know, uh, I know him. Continue to get the best. 
Hey, we're we Always good to see uh, people here. I'll be there tonight too. Oh yeah, come tonight. You guys are coming to Hey, how's it going, brother? Big fan. Thank you, brother. Doing a live stream here. Uh oh, I'm about to go live now too. Are you? Yeah. What are you going to talk about? We're doing Atomos. Yeah. Oh, well, you're going to Atomos? No, 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 no. Atomos is coming. Atomos here. is here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. About... Condor Blue is always doing cool things here. Yeah. yeah. We're, gonna, we're gonna talk in about 15 minutes. We'll be live. What are you going to say? I don't know. They're going to interview me. Oh, you're going to interview. So you don't? It's not on a particular subject. No, 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 no. Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm sure it's on their products. So. Oh yeah, they wouldn't be asking you about right. yeah the DJI products or yeah. I, I, I get it. I get right, it. Right, right, right. Let's go. Let's not. Hey, I do love your stuff. Thank Keep you, it brother. Up. Thank Thanks, you. man. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's fun. Always nice to meet another creator, another creator, as if I could hang with these people. Actually, one thing I have noticed is that I can hang with these people. These are really, really nice people. Oh, let's go over here, though. I wanted to show you this. My goal in life is to be a content creator that is so good that I can either have enough money to buy one of these body caps for Condor Blue or they'll give me one because I'm as cool as the other content creators here. Well, everybody needs a dream. And you know what? I don't even know why I want one of those. What? What? But I want a, a body cap. Yeah. Yeah, it's cool. All right. Let's go on over here. I want to show you uh, something else. This is a company uh, that called Roe. Let's see what I've got here. I've uh, stumbled across these guys. Yeah, Roe is pretty cool because they're the ones that do the screen for the Mandalorian stage. And these guys are buzzing, man. Whenever they have a presentation here, this place is full because these uh, screens that they have here are freaking amazing. And uh, yeah, all this VR stuff. And of course, this turns into a whole VR stage with very little effort and they do demos over here all the time, which I think is pretty cool. Now, again, this is stuff that's outside of my reach, but it's always fun to come to see what the new tech is at NAB. And yeah. This isn't actually even that new, but I'm sure they have new things because they're always getting better and better. So you've got this great modular system here. Yeah, fantastic. Well, someday, maybe in my studio, I'll have a huge wall like that uh, behind me so that I can pretend to be on some distant planet. Okay, probably not. Probably just gonna be me in the pocket three. So I I Well, Sony announced a new lens this morning. Uh, um, it was the uh, 16 to 35 millimeter G lens. And it has a declickable aperture ring, and it's a 2.8. Uh, it is uh, $1,100, though, so it's not a cheap lens. It's not a G Master lens. In fact, if I didn't already own the power zoom lens, the 16 to 35 f/4, I'd probably buy that lens. I'm going to see if they have it at the Sony booth. So I'm going to speed this up and go to Sony. See if they have it. Here we go. Here we are at the Sony booth. Let's see if uh, if they have this lens somewhere. I like to think, where would you put that lens? If you were going to have that lens, and you're going to pull it out. Where would it be? Well, let's see if we can ask someone. One thing about Sony is they're so big. They have so many offerings. They have so many uh, broadcast things, very high-end stuff, that it kind of dominates their booth. And so little guys like me, well, there's not much here for us, but occasionally we'll find something like, there's a few lenses over there. Let's see if somebody has some information for me. Hey, how you doing? Good, how are you? Good. So this is the, I have this lens, the power zoom. Is that yeah. what the power zoom is? But do you have the, the new one you just announced today? Yeah. <gasps> There it is, in all of its glory. You do have it here. There it is, 1625. 
It's got a deep clickable aperture ring, I think. Yeah, and, and it's a 2.8. A 2.8. Throughout the zoom range. Yeah, unlike my 4.0 over here. Yeah. Probably would buy this over this, but I already have that. Right, and you don't have, um, this doesn't have a power zoom, but it's a, it is such an easy throw. Yeah. But it's pretty easy to do a smooth. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't use the power zoom. I don't zoom much. It's oh, okay. kind of a gimmick for me, but but it does go to 35, and I do find myself going to 35 a lot, so it would be hard to give that up yeah. for me if I had the 16, the 25, but it's pretty good. And price-wise, too, this is $1,100? Yeah. Uh, what is this one? I can't remember. Uh, I'd have to look it up. Okay. Um, I won't make you, I won't make you work, Todd. I don't keep them all in my head. As much you don't as keep them up in your head? <laughs> what's, what's the problem? Some prices I do. No, no, that's all right. I, th I My memory was it was less. Yeah, it is less. It's an F4. Yeah. So maybe maybe still maybe still the better choice for me. But that, that's great. You got it on a uh, oh a, is that an A93? Oh, look at you. Well, that's something I really should be looking at because I haven't even touched one. Wait, wait. I've only touched one once, and it was right now, live. Oh, that's awesome. That's great. Yeah, you got it all rigged out here in a nice rig and. It's fantastic. Oh yeah, there it is, the Alpha 9, there's the EV, ZV-E1, got an Alpha 1 over there. You know, I have this lens too. Is this the... Yeah, yeah, and for video this is great. I'm not a wildlife photographer, so I don't need more than that. And you get a lot of compression anyway, naturally out of telephoto, so I love that lens. Well, thanks for showing that to me, Todd. Pleasure. Thanks so much. Thanks for coming by. Nice to meet you. You too. Well, there you have it. Um, that's a tough lens choice. I'm glad they're always coming out with new lenses, though. But what I'd like to see is a new camera. And Sony's been a little slow in cameras for 2024. Okay, I know it's only April, but uh, usually we would see something by now. But I'm expecting some really good things. In fact, I did an entire video about my predictions about what Sony's going to do. These are my New Year predictions. And so far, by the way, I'd like to say I'm not wrong because well, they haven't done anything, so I'm not wrong. I'm not right yet either, so if you want to see those predictions, that would be awesome. I'll try to put a link there. If I get around to it, I still haven't linked everything on the day two video. In fact, I'm so tired. <laughs> Andy B just wipes me out, but you know what? It also exhilarates me because I love to see this stuff. Well, that's pretty much it for today's live stream. I'm so glad that you stopped by and um, yeah. Please subscribe if you get a chance. I have, have a lot of things to say. And um, as I often try to say, I like to talk. So if you like to listen, well, that would be freaking awesome. We'll see you in the next one.